But at Hyperverge, we take ownerships of largest projects that people could ever work in their life. So the NIST is an ongoing leaderboard that the Department of uh, Commerce maintains in the US and face recognition companies across the world, we compete on getting a spot on the leaderboard. And this becomes a big deal because it's from the, like, directly from the uh, Department of Commerce from US and it's also often called as uh, Olympics of uh, face recognition. If you look at the NIST leaderboard, uh, you would find a lot of companies which are, you know, uh, unicorns, billion dollar revenue companies, which are massive, thousand, ten thousand, one lakh people teams. It's companies like SenseTime, Idemia, and NEC. And NEC is the biggest uh, biometrics provider in the world. So these are kind of companies which have like hundred, hundreds of folks working on just one problem. And to be on the top, obviously there's a lot of data engineering and uh, algorithmic engineering that we do. So there are two leaderboards, one is the one is to one and one is to n leaderboard. So one is to one is for face verification, right? You have a face, you have a selfie face or something like that, you, you just verify, say whether these people are same or not. But there's one is to n, which is uh, kind of like, you, you have a face, a uh, query face, and you'll have to see in a database of hundreds of millions or billions of people whether this person is present in the database or not, right? We decided on participating in the leaderboard in uh, around the December 2020 and uh, we made a submission in the beginning and uh, we, act we are actually ranked as the last. We are literally the last uh, company in the leaderboard. There are around 273 two companies on the leaderboard and around 400 submissions. Uh, so it was pretty embarrassing that we had the last of the leaderboard and ultimately we got to know that it was a very small mistake that we, we did. But I guess this was a very good learning experience for us um, and uh, since then we haven't done any mistakes and the next immediate next submission that we made, we are in the top 10. We have multiple benchmarks in the 1 is to 1 leaderboard itself. In one of the specific data sets that they benchmarked us on, we are ranked globally second. So we are competing against those companies with a limited, you know, three people, four people team, with limited resources, with limited time, limited bandwidth. So we are able to go head on against these people and still, you know, come out on top. The kind of problems we solve, uh, they actually serve for the entire world. Currently, more than 600 million people have already used our systems in the last few years. We want to ensure that the work that we do is as meaningful as possible. In that process, we also want to ensure that you know we are ethically in the right direction. So this cultural thing reflects even in our face recognition team, in the AI team, and within Hyperverge, we have given utmost importance to make models really unbiased, right? And we have taken steps at every step of the data, of the algorithms. So um, a lot of emphasis has gone into bias, and we have been working to mitigate that. And that's completely because of the kind of people we have in our company, the kind of mindset each person has, and you know the direction in which we are all focused on heading towards.